Hi everyone, my name is Salwa Suzy and I am your only certified relationship and sex coach in South Sudan. This is just a continuation of the personal hygiene series that I have been doing lately. Uh, we already uh, talked about oral hygiene and I also did speak about body hygiene. And with body hygiene, there are so many tips or practices that we're supposed to undertake to ensure good hygiene habits. If you haven't watched my previous videos yet, find them on YouTube at Salwa Suzy. It would really mean so much to me if you could subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. Uh, we talked about regular bathing and making sure that you wash your hair frequent enough for the ladies. So today, I am going to talk about wearing clean clothes. Now, after bathing, of course, comes what do you put on your body? Now, we have people who wear the same clothes for up to a week. The people who shower and then put on the same clothes again, and then tomorrow they shower, they put on the same clothes again. Now that is not very hygienic because you're putting, uh, you've washed your body, it is clean, but you're repeating the same clothes that you had on when your body was still dirty. Meaning you're putting on dirt back to your skin after you've washed it. So you keep repeating the same thing over and over again. And your clothes do smell when you wear them for a long time without washing them. Every time you shower, make sure to put on clean clothes. And not only clothes, but also your underwear. Now, people have a tendency of wearing the same boxers or the same underwear, knickers, for three to four days. And especially for men, you can go up to a week just wearing the same boxers. Now, some of you have these boxes that have gone from like a bright color to a very darker color. I don't have men's boxes here today. I would have shown you, but I'm going to use ladies underwear. I had to make this really um, dirty enough just so you could see what I mean. Some of, um, some of my fellow ladies, actually, uh, you have underwear that look like this. I don't know if that's very clear enough. Uh, it's not very clear, but I hope you get the picture, you know So yeah, some of you have underwear that look like that you cannot wear the same underwear for more than once An underwear is only one once and once you shower you wash it and hang it up to dry and wear a clean one Now your clean underwear are supposed to look like this and I'm going to show you the bottom of it. See? That's how your underwear is supposed to look. Clean. As simple as that. So practice wearing clean clothes. Wash your clothes often enough. Wash your underwear often enough. Now for women, the reason as to why your underwear end up looking, you know, the way this did, the brown and, and you know, and very stained, is because when you pee or when you use the bathroom for a short call people call it a short call here but um when you urinate and you don't wipe yourself there remains or there are some drops that are left that will go onto your underwear and with time that repeating that over and over again leaves you in a place where your underwear starts to get stained not only does it get stained, but you will also develop infections because that area, your, your area, your body area, the, I know you call it a vagina, but the next time I will actually explain to you what every part is called. But let's call it a vagina for now, the way you do. That area is supposed to be dry. It's supposed to be kept dry and not wet. So whenever you urinate and you don't wipe yourself, you've left that area wet and prone to infections. You're already making your underwear dirty, staining it with urine, and in the process, you're also uh, encouraging bacteria to grow because there is wetness over there. So women, learn to wear your clean underwears. Wash those dirty ones every time. Wash them with soap. And just make sure you give them a really good scrubbing to 
just so they're clean. Now, the other thing I didn't mention is that when you urinate and you don't wipe yourself, apart from that area being prone to infections and apart from it obviously staining your underwear, the other thing that happens is that that urine gives out a smell. I know people have said that the women who smell, and trust me, sometimes it comes from those dirty underwears. It comes from that urine that remains and uh, it remains in your underwear. So that gives that that gives out a smell actually. So learn to wash yourself clean. Learn to wipe every time you use the bathroom. I don't care what it is you do in the bathroom. Make sure you wipe so that you keep your, you keep that area dry and clean. So it's clean clothes, clean underwear, and um, make sure you wipe often enough for my fellow women. Um, I hope this is going to help you. I hope you do take this seriously. This is really, really serious, especially for us women. It is very important that we keep good hygiene because our bodies actually operate in an entirely different way compared to men. So ladies, 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 I always emphasize for the ladies, let's keep good hygiene. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for always following and, you know, sharing my, my videos out to people. Thank you for your comments. I do read them and I appreciate you guys. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to follow all my social media pages too. Thank you guys and I'll see you next time. Mwah.